Good evening. New tonight, a store clerk is behind bars accused of selling the dangerous synthetic drug Spice. San Diego narcotics detectives served a search warrant today here at Andy's Smoke Shop in Hillcrest. They found two pounds of Spice, allegedly. NBC 7's Dave Summers is there. He's got reaction from the community. Dave. Several businesses share this corner mark of 6th and University Avenues with Andy's Smoke Shop. They also share the transient and drug culture that exists here. After today, though, they're hoping that is about to change. In the struggle for survival, sometimes the hardest job for these small businesses is making customers feel safe. Matthew Lowe works the restaurant three doors up from Andy's Smoke Shop. Lowe has seen his tip jar and ice cream chest looted his facade defiled by those intoxicated passing by. You see people hanging around here that are uh, under the influence of spice and it just gives a bad, uh, just gives it a bad look. Cassidy Resendez runs the spa next door. It's definitely very sad. Obviously you don't want to, we don't want to see people dying or getting sick. Um, we already have a lot of drugs out there that are not yeah, good for people. Somebody sent them a Smoke shop employee Samir Kaskorkas, who wished not to show his face on television, is cleaning up after San Diego narcotics detectives searched every crack and crevice in the store Thursday. Police say they found two pounds of spice in bulk bags and some packaged for sale. Does this store sell spice? No, we don't. Co-worker Assam Shaba was arrested and charged with the possession and sale of the drug. Spice, sometimes called synthetic marijuana because of its similar high, caused a spike in overdoses last year, many among the homeless community here and downtown. Kaskorka says the smoke shop is unfairly targeted. Police say the store was under a court order not to sell it. I have no clue, but like I said, it could be anybody coming in, put something over here. The city is vigorously enforcing its recently passed ordinance prohibiting the sale of spice. If they can't get it in the neighborhood, then they're not going to be around here. Businesses are encouraged by this crackdown. Now the ordinance prohibiting the sale of spice does have teeth. The maximum penalty, $3,500 in criminal and civil fines, one year in jail, three years probation. Reporting live in Hillcrest, I'm Dave Summers, NBC.